How are you doing and how have you been? My name's Sazastical. This is Bane's Empire, his mechanoid dream, his accord. And what are we doing today? Have we got no components? Yes, yes, we have no components. Is components the one thing we need to progress? Yes, yes. Have we got many of other things? Yes. Are we a bit in trouble? No, because we have Bane leading us, party people. Uh, combat supplier? Was that? Oh no, it must be an old message. That's absolutely fine. Yeah, so what could we do? Well, we're going to have a raid. They're going to prepare for a while and attack at multiple angles. Um, nothing too scary over there. 11 of them. They are going to activate the bugs that are outside. They're going to activate these bugs, whether they know they're about to do that or not. This is why we have the amount of um, traps that we do. Because it gets us through here. The only weak part of our base is actually this bit. Because if these this door breaks or this door breaks, they avoid like all our stuff straight away. So we do need to be careful. We might have a new colonist today. That would be quite good. Okay. So what else can we really do at the moment? Not really too much. Right, let's see where these come. I'm hoping they just go straight. They're going to go straight into the bugs. They're going to get killed by the traps. They've woken up the bugs. And then the bugs should just die on all the traps. Oh no, they're going to kill the whole wildlife. We shouldn't have to do anything here. Uh, you're going to have to remind me. Do we eat... We do love insect meat, so this isn't actually the worst thing in the world. I mean, it's not amazing by any stretch, but... And that's why we went overkill with the traps. It's got one more trap to hit. How much damage? Half health just from that. Come on. Bit close for comfort. <laughs> That's what we call squeaky bum time. <laughs> right, Bane. Undraft. Oh, check check the wildlife first. Yep, yep, yep. Max unrestrict. Speed free. I'll make sure insect me insect me okay so that should all get hauled in what I also probably want to do is add a zone stockpile here just in that that orbital trade beacon isn't getting power clear all critical allow fresh corpses animal so then they'll get hauled straight into there Bane is already butchering them, which is actually really, really nice for us, but that's going to give us a great mood, including, I'm assuming you're already in our religion, you are, so you're going to love that as well. So that's why I don't mind sorting out the bugs like this or leaving them up, especially if we've got that amount of traps to sort them out. We have all the constructors to basically build them back up straight away, so it's not too much of a problem, question mark, like... Right, we've got some more steel over there, so I might grab it. Right, there we go. Okay, uh, the box out here is hot enough so bugs will spawn in there, so that's really nice for us. There are some steel in here that we got to grab as well. Mix art all unrestricted, and they're already building. Which is belly belly nice. We want an altar. I mean, we want a lot of things. I want components. But you don't hear me complain all the time. Well, maybe just a little bit. Right, Bane's making food out of insect meat, which is lovely. That will help our food stocks, considering the mistakes that we made. Sadly, we're not going to be able to expand this too much more, this room, just because of... The outside area, not that we're going to, because we're only going to probably have these two colonists. 
Just because Bane will get more upset the more colonists we actually have around. Right, the tunnel is getting started over there, which is nice. Just to make sure we've got steel in our back pocket. We're a very, very rich colony at this point. We're getting close to the wealth for where we left. The only problem that we're having is all the turrets and whatnot. I'm going to allow them all. Transport pod crash. I will have a look. You would have to be very good because we're going to be very... Oh no, it looks like the bear is eating you. See? That is a death that we can easily say was nothing to do with me and was not my fault. See? They do happen. We need so much more turrets here. I've only got one spare component. But at least the steel and everything else is getting hauled everywhere else. These are all made out of marble. Cooking. Steel. Problem is, there's so much down here. Are you telling me that like there's no components or anything? Volcanic winter. We get someone to join. So like, I can't do a volcanic winter. Oh, I could. Because then I could just chuck you in the rip scanner. Yeah. <sighs> do I care about a volcanic winter? I do care because this room will get too cold and we haven't worked out a way. Basically, I'm going to need to build a room. Maybe here with loads of heaters and whatnot that we leave the door open. So, like... Could build a room here. We could literally build a room here with loads of heaters, open these doors when bugs... But just mainly for the winter. I mean, we're not going to struggle for power in this colony anyway. But we have to worry about the problems that are going to kill us. Oh, not all the traps of... I thought they got the traps up a bit too quick. Bizarre. Starvation. Oh, this paramedic is rubbish. It's probably recharged. Oh, no. Hasn't even got that excuse. This tunneler is going to like end up killing it by accident. Killing him by accident. Which, at this point, you have to ask, does he deserve it? Does Marat deserve it? Like, we tried to help you. Well, we're not, because we're starving you to death, but... Capture. Right, can we feed him? Because the paramedic is rubbish. I don't even know what it's doing. Do you know what? Dumb. 
all that effort, all that work. This is why Bane stays alone. He doesn't have to worry about other people. Right, we probably are going to need to mine a hell of a lot more than what we're doing. So, let's get all the steel in here well, now that prisoner's gone. I imagine all that steel. Let's get all this steel up and then fill up the gaps. Because that's steel right there. Back to colonists. Why are they not hauling all that? So we got granite. Just watching how much food is actually in here. We've got loads of food now. I am seeing the power problems, yes. We can fill all that up in the meantime. Obviously, a lot of our constructors are doing the traps, which keeps us alive, so that's fair enough. Oh, chunks of spaceship! The construct! Components! That are just going to go straight into the turrets, but... Um, I'm just trying to think. I mean, it's going to probably be making sure our steel goes up just so we can replace traps for the next load that go up. We might have to go back to strip mining. Bane, come get the skill trainer. He went from level 13 cooking to level 15. That bear is just murdering everyone. I want to tame it. Oh, the trap shop. Oh, I like it when a plan comes together, party people. Um, have they not deconstructed that thing over here yet? I suppose they're gonna construct everything fast, but
Right, I'll mine down there just to see if I can find any components. This room will go quite deep anyway because we're going to want loads of mechs in the end. I mean, at least it keeps Bane busy, I guess. The tunnel are... What are you doing now? Right, there we go. I'm going to make that room. That's going to be our heater. Doesn't look like we're going to get any lucky. Oh, they deconstructed that. Some more turrets are going up, which I know you probably people are going to say I should prioritize other things. But it's like, even if I prioritize, let's say, the research bench... That wouldn't have given us enough components for it. Plus, then, if we research the fabrication bench, we haven't got then the resources to build the fabrication bench. So it's like, at least this way, getting more turrets up keeps us alive. fill that gap in just so there's more of a gap between this room. Just seeing if there's any more trees outside for some more wood. So I think this room might be getting to the point where it's too big. Found more steel, everyone. What we really needed. How wonderful. Just filling that up at the moment. Eventually, that'll be where mortars go and stuff like that. And grand penetrating scanner, but... We need more wood. Need more wood, my lord. Just deforestation everything. Just make sure everyone's got a job. 3k steel sitting around. Glad we got some more turrets up in all honesty. I want so many turrets that anything that comes at us just gets, like, blown away instantly. Uh, the cipher, you can stay in the base. I don't want you wandering around the map. Oh, look, not even all the wood was down here, my bad. I feel like this room... Because what I normally do is try and obviously balance it to the point where we can burn all the bugs that spawn in here, but then not burn them too much to actually get their meat and whatnot. I think with our waste pack situation and having the bugs spawn all around the map in their hives and then they're going to always get aggro to deal with, I think that's going to be an easier way to get bug me than worrying about doing it with this box so i think going forward this box is just plainly going to be as much wood as oh we found more steel everyone we found more steel brilliant oh i'm so happy awesome <laughs> any other series any other series i'd love the amount of steel we're getting any other series not this one 
If we hadn't have moved, we would have the fabrication bench up by now and this wouldn't be a problem. The fact that we moved... Hey! Where, where, where? Hey! Ooh, 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 ooh. Ton of luck, ton of luck. Don't worry, these, all these components are going to get used immediately. And we won't even know where they went, so brilliant. We might be able to get some more turrets up, which would be nice. Oh. I wish it was a big vein. I swear all these components are always like teeny tiny vein. Oh! Is that going to be the end? Yeah. And Bane gets that. There we go. Some more turrets going up. Very nice. This keeps us alive, so. And again, the components all went. Bane, where are you taking that? You're making EMP shells with components. I want to cry. I want to cry. I legit want to cry. We're getting an auto turret back up. Oh, we're getting some more turrets up. Yeah, the things that come... We're going to get to a position where we're very, very strong. If we can get like loads of melee mechs as well. To pretty much just run defense. It's tempted to get another tunneler to stay up here. The problem is, is because I know I could remove that to get the tunneler to stand here and like queue them up. The problem is, is my turrets are still going to shoot the tunneler, so it's like, I don't know how good that is going to be. I've got some mad animals, quite a few mad animals. I'll just let them go on the traps. Make sure the mechs are inside. This is where we find out loads of our mechs are not. Yep. Yep. Why is that mech even out here? Cutting trees down? Probably cutting trees down. It's another mech. Yeah, this is the only problem we have with like, the mechanoids, like when mad animals and stuff like that happen. To be fair, I think a lot of it is just because we're trying to grab, like, trees at the edge of the maps and stuff, so the mechs are quite far away. Right, there we go. Alright, did they all die to the traps? We'll go to wildlife. They're all gone. So now we'll go mechs unrestricted. Apart from the cipher and the paramedic. Bane, I don't mind. I'm clicking on the wrong button. You can go to the mechs hole. There we go. Mechanoid repair needed. The friendly mechs. Friendly mechs come here. Can I make sure we're not shredding friendly mechs? Yep, yeah, cool. Hopefully they get hauled back for Bane. I'll turn off the turrets for the time being. Waste pack infestation. That's fine. 
I have to send everyone to area one and then just adjust that to basically just stay away. The next dumping stockpile is going to be here. So I've noticed a lot of enemies come through this bit. So if we can get bugs here and here. Right, reconnected all them turrets so at least they're not nicking power from anything in here. So that might help a little bit. Just queuing up so much stuff now. Then I can run a power conduit in here. Uh, transport pod crash. Pyromaniac. No. Prison. Bane. Where is he? Cap shot. Okay, because then we'll just chuck him straight into the rip scanner. So at least we've got all them parts. What are they called? All them sub cores. I like to think when we see um, bugs passing through animal migration, that's from our past base. But that's quite a cool thing. Okay, so the door's going in here, because then we can leave them open and have the heater in here. Which I think we can all agree is going to be a good idea. I need to get rid of all these chunks, because mainly because they're annoying me. We just need more mechs to help us go quicker. Just need more components to get more mechs. It's a never-ending cycle. But, it's fair to say, Bane is thriving. In steel. And wealth is just casually going up. But we need to get ready for bugs. Right, I am going to make this a little bit deeper. Just because I'm very nervous with the amount that we're making our base bigger. So I just want to make sure infestations are going to spawn in this. Because otherwise we are in big, big, big trouble. Okay. Yeah, and then next time out... We continue the strip mine and to be fair we'll probably get all the um steel out and stuff like that equally we do have a trader or sorry a um comms console so it's not like if someone comes we can't do anything we could probably do with getting um shelves up in here in all honesty why have i done it all with slate so i'll just get loads of this is going to be our big warehouse So it probably makes sense to actually start getting the warehouse stuff up. So I am going to the way of that pause. Let me just link them now because otherwise they're going to store food on them and they're going to get it's going to get really annoying for me. Right, link. 
And then just don't allow food. Oh. And that one. Same. That one. Same. They shouldn't anyway, because this should these should all be critical, yeah, but, but but just in case there is an overlap or anything silly like that. There, yeah, then we can get everything on the floor, just to make sure we have enough room to store stuff. I mean, I think we do, but with the amount we're mining and stuff, it's just... It's better be safe than sorry. So, that's the thinking there. If you got to this part of the video, leave a like, leave a sub, leave a comment. And I'll catch you next time, party people. Bye!